Hey, welcome back. Uh, it is another episode. This time, like we said, we're gonna try to plug the VR2 headset into multiple devices. Because I have heard that it, it does work if, if it's a 2000 series because it uses a Type-C connector. So this laptop is a 20, 2070. Uh, uh, that's my laptop. That's yours. Mine's yours is a 3060. If, it's, if mine's a 3060, it might not work. It should no, still mine's work. a 3070. Is it? I don't know. I don't know. The, the point being, it's the laptop has a Type C port. This has a Type C, so we should be able to plug it in, and it should do something. So should we go get the 2070? My laptop isn't charged. Same plug. I don't know. Okay, that might be another video. <laughs> but anyways, okay. But a couple of devices here. So we have a iPad Pro M1. Why? Because USB C. Yep. I have a M2 MacBook Air, M2 yep. MacBook Air. Why? Because of USB-C. And he has a... We also have my M1 Pro MacBook Pro. So this has two Type-C ports as well as the HDMI. So if none of these happen to output anything, this might because it has the HDMI port. Okay. So we'll see. So which one do you want to go first? That's up to you. I say we try the easiest one, okay. which is the... Okay, I don't think we do. We need to. I don't think we need to fully put it on. But my iPad's on right now. Yep. Here you go. And what we will do is plug it in, and then you see. You want to take a look in there for me and see does anything light up? How about that? Okay. That would be the first indicator, right? Okay. I am not seeing anything. I just plugged it in. Hang on. Let me see when I go in my settings and see um, display to see, does it see a second display, okay? I do not see a second display. Well, you got, there's a power button down there too. Is there? Yeah. I don't think we're getting anything. Nothing? Nope, it doesn't look like it. So do we have an unsuccessful attempt one with the... It looks like it. I'm not able to get anything. It's not powering at all, powering on at all. Okay. So I think iPad with USB-C is not successful. As expected. Okay, true. So iPad, if you ever want to just use the VR2 as a monitor, as of right now, it's not gonna work. So that's the iPad. Okay, MacBook Air 2, MacBook Air M2. So, it's on, and I'm gonna plug it into, I have two ports. I'm gonna try the first port first, okay? So, powering this on. Okay, let me go into settings. Display. I am not seeing a display. I am also not seeing anything. Maybe I should put this on since it tracks my eyes. You can try it. I don't know how to get it on though. I, I think anything. you, um, doesn't it pull out a little bit now? This tightens it, I think. If we keep, then how the heck do you loosen it? This seems to keep tightening. Oh, you know what? Uh, Hello, you, you hold it down. Okay. Okay. Got it? I'm locked in now. Okay, you don't need to keep tightening it. <laughs> okay, I'm in, holding the power button, not seeing anything. Count to 10, how about that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Anything? Nothing. Nothing, zil. So, conclusion for us, hang on, let me move to the other port. Just in case. Port. Nothing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yep, nothing. Okay, so MacBook Air, if you try to use the VR2 as a second monitor, I don't think that's gonna work either. Okay, so on to the next guy, MacBook Pro. Pop this guy open and Justin, can you use your fingerprint? 
Did I hit you, it? You got it. All right, here wow. we go. So I'm going to plug this in. Holding the power button. I'm going to go under um, display it again. I hope you guys appreciate this because we're just taking every machine we can throw at it. Quite literally. This is like all of our laptops. Nothing, right? Yeah, I, I'm getting nothing. Okay, I'm gonna go to the other port. Yeah, still nothing. Okay, so there you go. Apple devices, no bueno. What I'm gonna tell you is that if you wanna try to use a VR2 with this, it's not gonna go. Now, this is gonna be the interesting one. This is the, gonna be the one with the NVIDIA RTX. Um, and I do expect this to at least power up maybe. I'm hoping for something. I seriously, uh, it recognizes something. Might need more power. Might need more power. It doesn't say it needs more power. Okay, let's see what happens, okay? Do you see anything? Hold on, let me put this back on. Do you see anything at all? I am not getting anything at all. Okay, hang on. I am under settings, and I type display. Seeing right now I'm not I'm trying to see does he even see a second display that's my goal I am not even seeing that that is showing me a additional display usually that's like the first thing you see right hopefully um, multiple display. detect I don't see an additional display Anything on your side? Does it even power up on your side? Nope. I'm I think just it, I think it has to be. It has to power up. Let me try a different USB C plug. Okay. Again. I hate to say this, but I think he might be right. This might be going back if it doesn't even support. It definitely does not detect a second display. And, and just so that we're all on the same page, um, the, yeah, right now, nothing. I, get, I, I got nothing. I'm still getting nothing. Okay. So. so what we were hoping for originally was at least get, um, we were hoping to get at least the, the unit to be able to use our, our um, laptops because it's a nvidia with usb-c to drive this vr2 and unfortunately we're just not successful there is one more thing we can try i think we should try to boot into steam vr and see what happens okay so let's do this so i do have steam on here uh let me go to here okay so we made some attempt downloading steam vr onto this yeah this is a 3070, by the way, and did not work. In fact, he made me pull up the video that showed that by plugging this unit into a 2000 series graphic card, graphics card actually worked. But to be fair, it was a PC. It was a PC. It was a dedicated graphics card. I should check mine and see if I do actually have a Type-C port or not. I don't think it does because it's a three series, but what I've have read, again, I've been doing a little bit more research with this than he, he have. So back in the days, they had these dongles that has a USB, a power plug, and an input. And this right now, when plugging into any of the Macs, um, and then and also even the Windows PC with Windows uh, laptop with the 3070 graphics card, it shows it does not have enough power to drive it. Right. So I think that power adapter comes into play. And the reason why that I think that guys uh, lap that. PC work because it was a PC and it doesn't need the extra power adapter to drive this unit. So we're going to keep testing it out, but stay tuned and see what happens. Till then, please subscribe and peace out.
Take care.